To add a table for this multimedia text set, I'm going to do this in a table style. I'm going to come up to the top here where it says table, insert table, and I think I will make mine um, two across and oh, at least um, six to seven down. I'll just start with six. Uh, and I'm ready to go to load the table up. Now, once the cursor is in here, I want to change the coloring. I usually leave these headers to be um, different color than the rest of it, but I'm going to go ahead and highlight all of it right now uh, because I do like this background to be white so that students can see very clearly in here. So I'm going to click on More and find the paint can. You might not need to do that. You might depends. Find your paint can, and that's the background color. If you click on this, then you can select white and it will change that. Now, right now it's highlighted in blue. If I click away, you'll see that it's white. So already the look of the page has changed. Uh, students will be able to see the resources in this table very clearly. Now I'm gonna change the header right here uh, to a different color. And again, all I have to do is click more in the paint can and I will do maybe um, a darker yellow like this. Um, and and once this is done, I can um, then select inside the um, space. Uh, right now it's going to do the text color is the same yellow color. I want to do it in a black. Um, and I can change the font if I like. I, I probably will leave it in the heading font, maybe a little bit larger. You can always change these as you want. And I'm going to put on this side resources. And if I get in front of this or just select in here and I select center, it will center it for me. And then in this section, again, I have to make sure the font is um, correct. I want to do it a little bit larger. And I might do um, uh, responses. Now you can put whatever you like on this side. Um, I like for the students to be able to record their thinking as they go through all of the resources. And so sometimes I might put your questions, your wonders, your ahas here. Um, and so you, if you want to add um, more uh, to your table. Just click into the space, uh, one of the um, parts of it, and you can do insert uh, row below, or you can click tab and it will just keep adding spaces as well. Um, it's another way to do it. Uh, you can change the sizing of your table. Um, if you want more room for the responses, you can move um, it over like this. And in order to increase the spaces here, you can just push delete and it will um, make them even. You can also go into a uh, table and go to table properties and you can change a lot of the dimensions. Um, you can even change the table border here at this point. Um, let's see what it would look like if it were yellow. I'm not sure if that's going to look very good. Uh, maybe not. Um, if you like it, leave it. If you don't like it, you can always click the undo button.